Hey YouTube, I'm back. Been gone for a minute. Had some stuff going on, but I am back. Why my eyes look so tired? It is kind of late. Anyway, I'm back with a review. King Richard came out a few weeks ago on HBO Max and in theaters. I wanted to see it in theaters, but something came up at the time that I was trying to do it. So I saw it on HBO Max. So for starters, I didn't know I didn't know much about Serena and Venus Williams except for the fact that they were bomb tennis players. Uh, the first time I learned about them was back in like 98, 99. I had this uh, little teen tween magazine called Girls Life. And that was the very first time that I heard of them was back then um, when I was a little kid, about 11 or 12 or whatever. And uh, so it was good to watch the movie and learn a little bit more about them. Um, before I saw the movie, I thought, you know, their dad was just like working them a whole, whole lot and it was all work, no play. But come to find out in the movie, he wanted them to work hard and play hard. You know, there were some times where he canceled practices with a like renowned coach, world renowned coach. I'm saying that kind of loosely because I don't know if he, but he coached someone who was like really, really good before. Uh, but anyway, he canceled the practice so Venus and Serena could go uh, to Walt Disney World. He wanted them. He wanted that equal balance, and I think that's so important, man, because it's like parenting is one of these things where you just gotta try it and see how it works. Because you're too strict, your kids get any kind of little freedom, they go wild. Uh, you're not strict enough. They go wild. So it's like you don't want the, the wilderness going on. You know what I'm saying? It's like a balance. So I think he did good with that. One thing I admired about the movie is that even though it's based on his 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 vision for his children, they did show the mother's role in the movie as well. She she wasn't just paint, playing like a supporting figure that you just saw you know every now and then hey girls time for dinner it wasn't nothing like that they showed her heavily involved too and kudos because you know when you think about serena and venus williams we don't always necessarily think about their mom too because their dad was so vocal he was he was the driving force but it's like you know moms had a hand in that too and i'm so glad that they paid i don't want to say paid respects because that sounds like death but I'm glad that they showed, gave credit where it was due. Uh, now, the movie's about two hours and 30 minutes long. I will say this. Even though it was a good movie, I don't see it being a movie that I just binge watch. Like, for one, I'm not a big sports fan. And in order for me to watch a sports movie, it's got to be more than one focus. Like, Remember the Titans, for example. I mentioned that in one of my other videos. I think it was the video of my favorite movies that took place in the South. But, you know, Remember the Titans was, yeah, it was about football, but it was about race relations. It was about, you know, social issues and all that. So it's got to be something I can relate to. See, King Richard was pretty much about tennis and the girls, um career in tennis I mean you had a few little a, a, a few you had some dialogue about race relations and things and um gaslighting going on between you know people thinking that you know Venus Serena weren't good enough and stuff so but yeah but to just like watch it all the time like man I'm finna go home and watch King Richard probably not it's just one of those movies where it's, it's good for, a, you know, a one time for me. The actors and actresses did good. Will Smith always does good. Even if he is he's in a crappy movie, which he has been in some in the past. Of course, he played the role perfectly because, you know, at the end of the movie, based on true story, they always show like the real character. I'm sorry, not real characters. The real people the story was based off of at the end. And he got Richard's mannerisms right pretty well so kudos to that i gotta get get back on netflix something happened to my account where they erased all my information and now i have to like start over again i don't know what happened 
But you're going to see some more Netflix reviews coming up, all right? But I'm going to turn it in because it's late. And I guess that's why my eyes look low right now. But as always, peace and blessings. Subscribe, share, and like. Please. If you want to. But anyways, peace and blessings, y'all. Have a good one. Bye.